How very nice of you to join us. And I was like, oh, dang. Hey, everybody. Welcome back to my world where no matter how old you get, you never need to grow up. Do you have recurring nightmares? You know, a recurring nightmare is a nightmare that you have recurringly, you know, often. Sorry, my doll stands are clanging together over here. It's making me crazy. Um, you know, I mean, and, and lots of people have very similar nightmares. You know, the um, unprepared for a test at school, the showing up to work naked. Um, you know, there's, there's just, there's all kinds of, you know, sort of recurring themes. Uh, teeth falling out is one that a lot of people have. I hate the teeth falling out dream. I do have the teeth falling out dream. Um, that's something like a uh, dream interpretation says that's like about a loss of control. Mm. I often dream that I'm in an out of control car where the brakes won't work, you know, things like that. But one of the recurring dreams that I have is, and I don't know if anyone else has this, so please tell me in the comments if you have this recurring dream slash nightmare, is that like I'm in high school and I need to get to class and I need to get my books and you know change books and I can't remember the combination to my locker. And I'm like freaking out because I cannot remember the combination to my locker. And my friends are just like talking and everything. And I'm like, hey, shut up, I can't remember that. And it's like the worst possible thing because I cannot get into my locker. I need my books. I need my notebook. My homework's in there. And I can't remember the combination to my locker. And it's like, I have that dream very, very often. So I don't know, like, you know, what the dream interpretation of that would be. But lockers are a very important part of high school. But little tiny lockers are a very, very important part of doll collecting because, <laughs> because we want our dolls to go through the locker experience. We want our dolls to stress out over forgetting their locker combination. <laughs> So anyway, I was in, uh, I, I was in um, Target. I actually went out because I'm fully vaccinated now. I am free to roam around um, uh, with a mask and social distancing and washing my hands. And um, I saw that uh, Real Littles, um, who do the, the backpacks, which I opened a while back, um, now have a Real Littles locker. And this is um, exclusive. This comes with an exclusive unicorn duffel bag. It's a pink locker with a pink unicorn duffel bag. And apparently this is what it looks like inside. Okay, our lockers were ugly and gray. I don't know about yours. So anyway, um, I don't remember how much this was, but I will put a link down below. I think you can get them on Amazon as well. Let's check. Let's check to see if we could. Did you know that if you have the Amazon app, you can just ch uh, click on the little camera icon at the top, scan a barcode, and it will tell you if it, yeah, oh, look at that, there it is. It's $19.99 on Amazon. So I'm gonna use an Amazon link down below so that if you buy it, it's an affiliate link, I might get a little commission so I can buy more toys. Um, yeah, so it's probably around the same price at, uh, at Target. And it's just so cute. It comes with wallpaper, stickers, chandelier, carpet, Carpet for your locker, okay. Photo frames, mirror, and more. And then right near it, they had new Real Littles, uh, are these the duffel bags? Uh, handbags, Hand, the handbags. So remember we had the backpacks, now these are the handbags. Um, these were the two cutest ones. We've got the sort of like a galaxy sparkle thing and then a unicorn theme. So let's, let's get this locker open and see what this is about. Um, so yeah, so that's, that's one of my, 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 my other, other high school nightmares tend to be around not being prepared for a test. My college nightmares are absolutely hysterical because there's a lot of basis in real life to my, my college. Um, so so uh, if you're in college and you're watching this, do not use me as an example because I want you to know right now, I graduated by the skin of my teeth with a 2.9 average, it took me five years because I was such a slacker. I went through a prep, I went to like Catholic school, Catholic school for 12 years. And the high school I went to was a prep school. It was, it was a high school, it was a college prep school. It was a very, very competitive. Um, oh, it's plastic. I thought it was gonna be metal, but plastic is okay. Plastic's okay. I would have liked metal, but plastic will do. But my dolls are plastic. Oh, look, look, it's a pink locker. Please tell me I don't need to know a combination because like that will, that will freak me out. 
I'm not going to lock it until I find out the truth about how this works. Oh, I think it's just, okay. I think it's okay. I think you just turn the dial. Okay. All right. We just have to turn the dial and then, and then, uh-oh, turn the, okay. Woo! Woo! Um, so anyway, oh, we had, there's, there's, there's crafts to be done. Oh, there's stickers. There's, oh, oh, and I can decorate the, the outside. Oh, okay. All right. So I can choose how to decorate my, my locker. Okay. All right. Um, so my college, as I was saying, my college nightmares are uh, based in, in fact, excuse me. I just, I think all of the stuff that goes in the locker is in my, my duffel bag here. And then I think, yeah, this is just packaging. They could probably package this with a little less cardboard. Uh, anyway, so my college years, what I did in college was, um, I, uh, my first year I went to a college that I chose because I wanted to be a teacher. And then, uh, once I was there, I, I really didn't like the school very much. Um, I, I was a commuter. I didn't go away. Um, and I was on, um, grants, uh, federal grants because we couldn't afford for me to go to college any other way. Uh, they were not scholarships. They were grants. Um, I just needed to maintain a, a reasonably okay grade point average. I also had to work. Oh, there's my mirror. Um, you had to work in order to keep your grant, but you couldn't work more than 37 and a half hours a week. So I worked 37 and a half hours a week on the books, and then any other extra time I could pick up was off the books under the table. That's right. I worked full time, went to school full time. And uh, so I transferred over to Rutgers for my second year. Um, part of that was just, I think the, uh, the English program at Rutgers was so much better at the time. Um, and I realized I could, I could get it, I could get a teaching certificate, you know, in, in either, in either school. And then here's my stickers. So, so at Rutgers though, uh, a lot of my friends that I went to high school with did go to Rutgers. What is this? Oh, is this a shelf? It's a shelf. Um, and, uh, but some of my friends went to Montclair State too. So it's kind of like, I think this is a shelf. Probably putting that in wrong. Okay, there you go. It's a shelf. Yay. And okay, so the carpet goes at the bottom. Um, so when I got to Rutgers, they had, um, okay, let's be honest. It's the reason I went to Rutgers. There's two reasons I went to Rutgers. One was they had a radio station and I really wanted to be on the radio station. Really, 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 really wanted that. Montclair State's radio station, you had to be a communications major to be on the radio station. Rutgers didn't have a communications program, but they had a radio station. So anybody could be on the radio station. Hence the transfer, because music was like everything to me back then. And then uh, also the other reason uh, that I was really excited to go to Rutgers, uh, my friends went there, and my best friend that I worked with went there, and there was a boy. So, um, <laughs> like I said, don't do what I do. So these are my two, wait, are there three? Oh, so there are three options to decorate my locker. I'm not an animal print kind of chick, so that, that one's out. Um, this is very cute, but I think this is very classy. I'm gonna go with classy. Keep it classy. Um, all right, let's try to decorate my locker. So, uh, this feels very my froggy stuff, I'm afraid. Uh, so this is the back sticker, back wall sticker, okay. Back wall sticker bottom. Oh, these go inside. Okay, all right, these go inside, not outside, Melissa. Door sticker. Okay. All right. Fine. I can put it on the outside if I want to. Okay. So back wall sticker top. Okay. okay. So, um, so I spent a lot of time working on the radio station. Also the program board was like, we put on things, you know, like movies, concerts, all that kind of stuff. Probably should have figured out which direction this goes in before I decided to just do this. And um, so I did a lot of that. What I didn't do a lot of, okay, this is gonna be a disaster. Okay, yay, back wall sticker. Um, what I didn't do a lot of was go to class. <laughs> so <laughs> that's why I said, don't do what I did. Um, that was not probably the smartest thing I could have done. 
and I failed some stuff and had to take it over. And it was just, you know, it was a bonehead move of a young teenager who had freedom for the first time. This is why I don't craft. I can't even put stickers on straight. Okay, but you know what? It's my locker. I decorate it how I want. So, um, so anyway, here's my, here's my nightmare. Here's my college nightmare. The college nightmare is, oh wait, I gotta tell you my, my geology story first. So geology, I had to take a science, so I took geology. Um, and I didn't take geology because rocks for jocks. I took geology because I was really oddly fascinated by plate tectonics. Don't laugh at me. I was just really, it's something that I was very interested in. Um, and that's why I took geology. I didn't take geology because I thought it was going to be easy. Huh. So this goes around the door. Okay, and it goes through these two holes. Oops, oops, oops. Okay, so it is repositionable, you know, to an extent. Um, and, uh, but it was at eight o'clock in the morning and it was geology. And all of the tests came from the book and what you learned in lab. And I loved lab, I would never miss lab. I loved geology lab, learned a lot in lab. Um, and I read all of the chapters of the book because I was fascinated by it. But the lectures were like, oh my God, Professor Manspizer was like watching paint dry and it was eight o'clock in the morning. And sometimes I went, but I really didn't go a lot. And then like by the second semester, I think I went, because you have to take two semesters of it. The second semester, I think I went like the first day to get the syllabus. I showed up for the midterm and I showed up for the final. I want you to know, I got like a three something, um, in, in, in geology. Um, and like I said, I never missed the labs, love the labs. So I, <laughs> when I go to hand in my final at the end of the second semester, walk down the steps, walk up to Professor Manspizer, hand in my, my, my final. And he looks at me and he goes, how very nice of you to join us. And I was like, oh, <laughs> Dang! <laughs> but I still did really well on the final, and I think I grew like a 3-2 or something like that for the year in geology. Okay, I've decorated sort of the inside of my locker. It's not, not my best work, but hey, it's something. Okay, um, and so what is this? This goes where? Where does this go? Let's look at the picture, shall we? So what was, what's my recurring nightmare? So my recurring nightmare is that I show, oh, okay, it goes over here. I show up um, in a class, I walk into a classroom and it's the final or the midterm and I've never been to class. I have not read any of the stuff. I have no idea what's going on and, and it's, it's, this is it. They're handing me a final or a midterm and I have no idea what's going on because I've never been to class. So there's that. And then the other one is, um, okay, so this hangs up over here to put stuff in, which is, you know, kind of, all right, you have to kind of jiggle it a little bit, jiggle it just a little bit, but it, it fits. Um, there's a chandelier, like there's a chandelier guys that slides in over here. This is really cool. This would be really, really cool. This is a cool gift for young kids who like, who like, you know, want to be cool and have a locker and stuff. And if you love miniatures, well, you know, miniatures. Um, let's look at some of our things that we can now decorate our locker with. So there is, um, there's a sticker that says rock. Sure. I'm gonna put that right, right on this thing right here. Yay. Um, so, uh, oh, there's an, in, there's a picture of an Instax camera. Love me a good Instax camera. These are so cute. I remember when they came out, I gave them to all the kids. I think I just, oh, I just put the sticker on upside down. Not my froggy stuff. I need a rainbow. I need a rainbow. Gotta have a rainbow. Gotta represent. Um, where am I putting my rainbow? I'll put my rainbow on the outside. Put my rainbow on the outside of my locker, dang it. Um, oh, and there's a rainbow unicorn. I'm putting that on the outside of my locker too. So, uh, I don't know what I was talking about. Um, we were talking about school. We were talking about what a, what a, what a messed up individual I was, but I loved being on the radio station. Yeah. Um, oh yeah. So, you know, oh, oh, the other dream, the other dream, the other recurring nightmare, gotta get the rainbow down here was, um, and this is a fairly new one, kind of, kind of recent, like, you know, last couple of years. I can't find the classroom that I'm supposed to go to. 
So either I can't find the classroom or I don't know what time or where the class is supposed to happen and I can't find it. And I'm like totally freaking out. And um, what are these little things do you suppose? Let's look at the picture. And I can't find my friends and nobody has a course catalog. And I have no idea what's going on because see, there used to be a book. You're like, a course what now? A course catalog is a book. Oh, these hang on the back. Why? Oh, they're hooks. Oh, 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 they're, they're stickers and they hang on the back and they become little hooks so you can hang your crap off them. Oh, that's cute. So, um, see, it's sticky. And now I'm going to stick it at the back of my locker so I can hang my crap off it. Uh-huh. Yeah. Oh, look at how good I did that. That is totally straight. Um, and, uh, yeah. So you used to have like, it used to come out like in like a newspaper format and then you, you would pick your courses from it. You'd put them on a form that you then had to hand in. There's like no computerization going on at all. Okay. I got this one much straighter. I think I can still twist this one sort of. Okay. So there's my hooks. There's my hooks. And, um, all right, we're gonna put a we're gonna put a cassette tape because I'm so old school. Um, and uh, uh, I'll put that over here. There you go. Hey, da, da, da. I don't know what this is. Oh, this is my mirror. Oh, and my mirror goes right here. Oh, I just put a cassette tape where the mirror is gonna go. Oh well, nah, that happens. Um, I did not have a mirror in my locker. Do you have a mirror in your locker? Like, did I? I never I did not give a crap what I looked like. It was an all girls Catholic school. There was no point in giving any craps about what you look like. I don't know if this film comes off and it becomes a real mirror or what, I don't know. Okay, so I've got my mirror in here. I've decorated my locker sort of. Now let's see what's inside. Be very exciting. Oh wait, let me put my lock. Let me put my lock on my locker. Gotta remember my combination. Let's see what's inside. This is what I'm really excited about. What's inside. This is, and this is so cute because it does come with a carabiner so you can like hang this off your purse. Um, oh, I'm sorry, off of your backpack. Um, you know, if you're not an adult who collects this stuff, look at how cute this is. But wouldn't this make it look like a cute change purse or a place to put your keys? Um, or like you shove your mask in here, your hand sanitizer and hang it off your purse. And people be like, oh my God, that's so cute. Where'd you get it? And you'd be like, the toy aisle. Um, so <laughs> let's see what's inside. Ah, I'm so excited. Um, oh. I love the stuff inside these. Uh, yeah, so those are my nightmares. So do you have any recurring nightmares having to do with school? Um, skipping school? <laughs> Work? Okay, there's a lot of paper in there. Very poofy paper. Poofy paper! Poofy paper! Okay. So inside the really, really cute uh, backpack uh, or duffel bag is a notebook. Oh. Oh, with the real little logo on it. And it is not lined. Okay, so it is kind of a sketchbook. There is a thing, uh, there's a unicorn on a string, which I'm not sure what that's supposed to be. I'm just gonna hang it in my locker. Not, not if anybody understands the unicorn on a string. Does anybody remember the, the YouTube video, Bacon on a String? Now I'm gonna sing bacon on a string all day long. Bacon on a string, watch that swing. Oh, oh, that's some old school YouTube right there. I have no idea what that's supposed to be. I think it's just like a little charm. And then, and this is what I love, a working teeny tiny pen. Oh yeah. Like how cute is that? That is adorable, adorable. Look at this cute little pen and this cute little notebook. And they, you can even carry this around in, in your, uh, attached to your purse or your backpack with a mask and a hand sanitizer because it's pretty big in here. And also you could write down stuff, you know, or you could put it in your locker too because I think that's what this organizer thing here is for right here is to put our really cool Real Littles notebook. <laughs> I'm trying to do this looking in the camera. And now is the pen going to make it so that it doesn't close though? Would they design, would they design it like that? Yeah, that's not going to work. Nope. That doesn't work. Not going to work. It was worth a try though, but it will work with the notebook. Very cool. Oh, this is cute. This is really, really cute. And this is a good size for dolls. This is a huge locker. This is very much a locker like uh, I had in high school. Faux show. Faux show. All right, let's look and see what's in the other 
handbags, shall we? Although I love this one. Um, so that was the locker. That's $19.99. And um, let's see, who wants to hang out with my locker? Do you wanna, come here, here, sweetie. So this is, this is like, uh, this is a fresh doll. This is the locker. Um, She's taller than the locker, and that's fine because it's not my high school, and so lockers would be smaller than the dolls um, in the real world. So there you go. All right, let's see what's in this. Oh no, I just lost one of the. I just lost. Uh, I just. I just. I just lost O2 from my 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 Novi Star. Okay, so this is. Um, these are the things that you can get inside these. These are very cute. These are very cute. Um, these are like if you like miniatures. These are really addictive, and I and I, and, 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 I, and I just warn you, these are really addictive. Okay, this is so cute. Look at this. So it's like a mermaid theme, so it's got like fins and stuff. This is so sparkly, and it's got this cool carabiner. It's like a tote bag, so it's open, So, but it does snap. So it does have a snap. So I guess you could put a mask or something in here or a hand sanitizer or something, but don't put anything small that you would be worried that would fall out. Okay. What's inside? Oh, 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 wow. So I guess this is kind of a thing. They're like, oh, you can collect all these charms. So now we've got a mermaid charm. Okay. We've got some lip balm. Mm. It's sealed. Lip, lip balm. There you go. Lip balm. Love a good lip balm. Lip gloss. Sorry. Um, yeah. I wonder if it smells though. I wonder if it smells good. Scented lip gloss is like a thing. Oh my gosh. You remember the, um, what were those? The, the, the something bell um, lip glosses that smelled and some were flavored and like the root beer one was like, oh, let's see, does it smell? <gasps> smells like strawberry. Mm-hmm. Mm hmm smells like strawberry. It's it's not very glossy though. It's very waxy. Yeah, that's, but you know, I mean, it's more like lip balmy than lip glossy, but um, this is an eraser. This is a teeny tiny little eraser and I bet you anything that the sucker works. Let me try and get the plastic off of it. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. Oh, 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 oh my gosh, I love it. I love it so much. Um, ow. I don't think I drew blood. Okay, here we go. Here we go. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I'm opening stuff. Yeah, baby. So this is an eraser. It's an eraser. Yes, it is. It really is. Look at this. Oh, oh. It's a little eraser. Oh, you know, focusing would be good camera. It's a little eraser. It's a little purple eraser. I've got stuff on my hands. Oh, look at that. It's an actual eraser. It will erase stuff. And our little tiny pen. No, I can't get it back. Now I can't get the wrapper back on. There, I got the wrapper back on. Our little tiny pen. Look at how cute it is. What does it say on it? Thank you, pink. I can't read what that says. It says something and it's pink. Wait, where's my notebook? Oops, knocked a bunch of stuff over. You know, I never have nightmares about knocking stuff over though. <laughs> I guess it's such a part of everyday life that there's no reason to have a nightmare about it. Okay, so this is my notebook and this is pink. Ooh, this is cute. I love the little pens. I have the little pens from my, uh, from the backpacks. I have them in my office because they're adorable. Okay, so that's what we got in this one. Um, there's all, cause there's 30 surprises to collect. Okay. Mm-hmm. These are the real little's handbags, not to be confused with the backpacks that came out before. Now this is the unicorn one, not to be confused with this unicorn sparkle handbag, duffel bag that you can only get if you get the locker. Now there were different lockers too. I just went with the pink unicorn one, but I do believe there were other lockers. Okay, let's see what's in here. Oh, 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 my dolls are gonna be very happy reusable water bottle you know, for your dolls or, you know, for you, if you really just want to sip, you know, just a tiny sip, like, you know, in the desert, this is all the water you can find. This is the perfect size bottle for that. Um, and then what, oh, oh it's like, it's like, a, it's, it's, it's a faux kitty. It's a fellow kitty. It's like a faux, um, hello kitty thing. 
that's kind of cute. Um, what else is in here? There's a lot in this one. Notebook! Oh, Real Littles 2021. It looks like a magazine, but it's really just another little notebook. That is so cute. Oh my gosh, how cute is that going to be like in a doll living room or something? Mm. Ooh, there's a lot in here. Um, this is, what is this? It opens. I don't know what it is, but it opens. But like, how fun is this for like your dolls to have these miniatures? You know, if you're not as talented as, oh, it's a little compact with a mirror. Oh my gosh. It's like, oh, all my all my, my 18 inch dolls that I just got are gonna love this. And uh, this one has a star. So we get a star charm on this one. And we get a pink eraser. That is like our other eraser. This is really cute. This is very cute. I guess you could put this in there. Yeah, I guess you could put that in there and kind of have the world's tiniest um, uh, uh, thing. The world's tiniest what? I don't know, Melissa. I can't speak. And it has like the strap across the back, so I guess you could... I don't know, guys. What would we do with the strap? Would we just carry it on our hand? Does it hang off of something? Where does it go? I know I'm missing something really important about the straps on the back. Help me. Help me figure it out. So that one didn't have a lip gloss, but it had more little accessories in it, so that's kind of cool. Um, so these are the Real Littles handbags. This is so cute. This could sit on my desk and just be like like a little knickknack holder, you know, like little things you don't know what to do with them, but you don't want to throw them away. You just stick them in there or like, like, ooh, ooh, uh, paper clips. This is really cute. I love this one though. I love, I'm going to hang this off my purse to keep my masks and stuff organized. And then the, um, the locker, which is kind of... The locker, which you cannot forget the combination to because there is no combination praise the Lord. So I don't have to have that nightmare come true on a regular basis when I'm trying to get into my cool locker. So this is really fun. If you're a doll collector, these are super cute. They were not that expensive. I think they're under $10. Um, so, you know, cute little, cute little thingy. Um, I'm really digging this. I love this. This is, this is, this one is my, this one's my fave. This one's my fave. Let me know which one is your favorite. And uh, I can't wait to hear everybody's nightmares. Like, I really want to hear your recurring nightmares, especially if they have anything to do with school. School. Oh, my goodness. College. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. So thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this, and I will see you again real soon. Bye!